What's up guys? I am all checked in in downtown LA for the LA Fit Expo. I'm going to show you guys what I brought food wise um, and all the things that I brought so that I can stay on track because I am in prep and it's going to be a long and busy weekend and I'm going to be away from home. Alright y'all, so I brought four packets of tuna. Tuna is so awesome when you travel because it comes in these perfectly portioned little pouches and it does not need to be refrigerated so it's super accessible and super easy. It won't spoil. Another good non-perishable that I'll be eating a lot of um, for my carbohydrate sources this weekend is rice cakes. This is just one pouch. Got a couple more in my suitcase. As far as food goes, I brought several bite meals. This one here is um, a meal of chicken, rice, and green beans. I brought all frozen meals so that they could be fresh, although I do have a refrigerator here, so I'll let them thaw out just a little bit. I brought two containers of tilapia, and this together is one pound of tilapia, so this should last me all weekend. And then I also brought two of the pancake, egg white, and chicken bacon meals. I'll be eating those for breakfast tomorrow and on Sunday morning. So I've got my breakfast meal, I've got my proteins between my pound of tilapia and my tuna. I've got one pre-portioned meal of chicken, rice, and green beans. I've got a bunch of rice cakes for my carbs. I've also got some almonds for my fats. I have all of my vitamins and supplements portioned out into this container here for the weekend. I brought stevia for my coffee. I brought a couple of Smooth Move tea tea bags just in case there's any sort of bathroom issues this weekend. And most importantly, I have a gallon of water that'll last me for tomorrow, and I'll pick up another one for Sunday as well. I brought my scale as well so that I could weigh out the perfect portions for my meals. Um, and that's gonna do it. Not a ton of variety this weekend, and that's okay because I'm gonna stay on track, and that's what matters most. Very easy, I packed all of this literally within 15 minutes, and I was ready to go, and I know that I'm gonna stay on track and be prepared, so that gives me tons of really good peace of mind. That's it, that's how you stay on track when you are in a hotel or away from home. Super easy, there's lots of different options you can do when it comes to non-perishables, and I could have gotten way more creative with my meals, but personally, I like to to keep it simple so this is what I'm working with this weekend. I packed it all in my six pack bag here. I've got my little ice packs inside and the refrigerator is right there so I will be putting my food away and getting some work done for the rest of the evening and that's it. Day one of the LA Fit Expo. My girl Jess killed it with my makeup as always. I am with team bodybuilding.com this whole weekend. I am so excited to meet everyone, to see everyone. Since this video will go up after the LA Fit Expo, if any of you came and you saw me, comment below and let me know. I am so pumped, so here we go, day one. 45 minutes later and we are just now approaching the LA Convention Center. They told us our hotel was walking distance. Right. I don't know what kind of country they consider 45 minutes walking distance, but got my cardio in for the day, so that's done. I'm here with my favorite bae. Hi! If you guys aren't already watching or following or subscribed to Taylor, you need to just because look at this pretty mug. Oh my gosh. I love you I love her. I miss her. I miss Babe. We haven't seen each other since June. I know. You guys might remember Taylor from my uh, weekendbodybuilding.com vlog that I posted like forever ago, back in June. And I got my coffee, so that's why I'm smiling and I'm just so excited right now. And I have this hair in my mouth stuck to my lip gloss. Yeah, that's it. Catch you guys soon.
mean I made it, fam? <laughs> yeah, you made you mean it. I made it. We made it. You fam, not my cards. <laughs> Die. Die. Introduce yourself to my channel. What up, team? My name is Drew Brooks. I'm the top five balance of bodybuilding at Costco. Are you so excited? I'm two turn right now. Finals are like in less than an hour. Did I get to help out backstage? I don't really know what that means, but I'm not <laughs> is a wrap eight hours was it eight or nine Two. I don't even know I lost count nine to but these wedge six. sneakers are all yeah. fun and games until like the fifth count. hour on them yeah, nice. my feet are tired but it was amazing met so many incredible people literally expedited the entire spokes model search show Amanda and I I don't know how we pulled it off but we did it congratulations to the new spokes models Christy Bailey and Nick Cheadle you guys all looked amazing up there. There was no one clear winner. Every single one of them were fantastic. And we are headed back to the hotel. I'm starving and all I really want is a warm meal and something warm to drink. You guys know about my love for the counter. We are back. I love this place because you can customize. Based on your macros, I can always find something here to fit. So this is perfect, prep friendly place to go. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm ordering. drunk by the end of an expo. Yeah, I don't know it's why. It's weird. We can't function. Yes. I think you just get like the lighting, the lighting oh. and like you just get like delusional after talking to so many people. I'm like so behind on macros right now which is very exciting because I have enough macros for sweet potato fries. This is how you eat out on prep guys. You go somewhere where you can customize your meals so I have a third of a pound grilled chicken breast over a bed of lettuce and baby spinach, some sprouts, carrot strings, grilled onions, some grilled mushrooms, cucumbers in there, and some sliced tomatoes as well. Everyone else's looks super bomb though too. Oh Taylor, let's give it a spin. There we go. What are you guys working with over here? Bison, pretzel bun. That pretzel bun is life. Beef on a pretzel bun. Yum. Time to dig in. First warm meal of the day. like already in sloth mode <laughs> in our sweat Activated. I had to check out of my hotel room this morning so I'm just crashing with Taylor for a little bit and then we have our bodybuilding.com team dinner at 7 15 and I'm looking at these pigtails right now and they're just not that cute so well, I'm sorry about that so I'm gonna look at the menu first see what I can fit into my macros for the day I am definitely macro hoarded again oh un gosh. unintentionally again today but the expos are just non-stop go 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 that you either don't have time to eat or you're just like so running on f like adrenaline and excitement that you just like forget to eat honestly um, and I know that's really bad especially being in prep but I am okay I will make sure that I hit my macros by the end of the day and yeah so it's just like an everyday thing no it's definitely not so um we'll be okay just one one or two days of it is fine and i've been good with my water today so i've been chugging water i didn't live on insane amounts of caffeine so that was a plus for me today yesterday i had like two coffees and i've been off coffee for a little while too so i was like feeling all sorts of like caffeine buzzes yesterday <laughs> This is 
the main reason why I flexibly diet and follow an if it fits your macros approach, french fries. If it fits my fat ass. Brian follows an if it fits your mouth approach. Not all fun and game. I got a grilled shrimp salad, so I just basically asked for a plain salad, no cheese, no croutons, and then I asked for some grilled shrimp, it's in there, uh, cooked in no butters and no oils, and my carbs are going to come straight from these bad boys. It was incredible, and I'm so thankful for every single person that came by and said hello, all the hugs, all the stories. I honestly leave these weekends with the most fulfilled heart and just like this is the reason why I'm so grateful to be able to do what I do like you guys make it all so worth it and I just have like a permanent smile for days now so everyone that I got to meet this weekend if you're watching this thank you for coming by thank you for talking to me thank you for the hugs thank you for your stories I love you guys so much so thank you